Our story begins on October 20th, 1947, where the House of Un-American Activities Committee begins their investigation on the communist infiltration in Hollywood's film industry. The man leading this investigation was Congressman Pernell Thomas, who is influenced by McCarthyism and the massive fear of communists taking over America. Many members of the film industry, such as Disney or Warner, didn't want the investigations to begin due to their own scandals that could be exposed, such as drugs and adultery. Many actors, writers, and directors went through these scandals, such as Julie Garland, commonly known as Dorothy from The Wizard of Oz, who had a drug addiction and had died from it. No matter the Hollywood suit's opinions on these topics, the HUAC continued their accusations. And with the first investigation brings us the ten. The Hollywood Ten. These men were writers and directors of movies that became popular in the late 40s, such as Salt of the Earth, The Master Race, Murder, My Sweet, and Blockade. Yet after they were accused and arrested for being communists, they were denounced as Marxist propaganda. But who were these men? The ten included Alva Bessie, Herbert J. Bieberman, Lester Cole, Edward Dimitrick, Ring Larder Jr., John Howard Lawson, Albert Maltz, Samuel Ortnitz, Robert Adrian Scott, and Dalton Trumbo. Several reacted differently to punishment. Most of the men were outraged, such as Alvia Bessie, who stated that the HUAC is a precursor to a fascist regime. Robert Adrian Scott attempted to sue RKO Pictures for not letting him keep his job as a playwright, but failed as the court rejected his case. Lester Cole and Edward Dimitrick, both directors, moved to England to continue their line of work. John Howard Lawson moved to Mexico for the same reason, to continue as a Democratic playwriter. Dimitrik had a much shorter sentence than the others at only six months for naming 26 other communists. Almost everyone had at least a year in prison. The Hollywood Ten made an impact on the film industry, more so in the HUAC's second investigation, to avoid suspicion of communism on their behalf. Some relate the HUAC's investigations to the Salem Witch Trials, as after the first, Many were falsely accused Just, uh, uh, just don't watch I mean, uh... Oh, it's finally working! Okay, uh, l listen, look, okay, the, I don't have much time to explain here, but I'll, I'll be there in a minute, okay? Uh, the, the, the communists and the Americans? Okay, they're 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 limiting me. So I'm I'm gonna come and meet you in person. All right. Uh, j j just wait there. Okay. The the communists and the Americans are.